make this all happen. He's got to be thinking inside his cockpit right now. Oh, helmet. big crash! Thomas Schechter down the backstretch at the end of the backstretch. There's the contact and Greg's car up into the wall. And that slow-mo. Oh, and here we go at full speed. That's just so quick. No time to react and to it because it's just phenomenal. Just listen. Here's our Corvette coming back up, just making a pass. Oh, there's hit. Oh, oh tremendous. No. Oh, two cars flipping. Oh, the Jag has flipped over very badly. And now a fire breaks out in one of the cars. I'm not sure who is involved. Terrifying, right? And we have a, another angle. Here's the replay. Look at the Jag starting to take off right here. There's the back off the ground as the probe is going up on the rail. The Jag is totally airborne at this point. Unbelievable. Watch the car and runs away. Another view of it. He just hit the back of Nguyen's car, missed his braking completely, almost went over the top of Nguyen, and then the car barrel rolled. with a horrible crash here on the front stretch. It has torn out a complete section of protective railing separating it. Alan Kowicki becomes involved. Debris and is collecting other cars. There is a lot of debris in the front. of 60,000 racing miles on it. Boy, talk about a used car. So the, oh, an elm oh, my over heavens. Just almost out of control, comes way up in the air off the hill. I don't think you wanted that at all. You've got to dive down low. You've seen what Briscoe could have done. This is it. One oh. lap. Oh, there goes Ryan Hunter, Ray and Ryan Briscoe. And Briscoe flies. Oh. Briscoe flips and flies. Just start bouncing off of each other here. Hunter Ray was going for a gap. It closed and he came down into, into Brian and the grass just caught the car and just flipped it. Side, Graham Holmes and John Bootman. Side by side, Bootman's going to shut the door here. Oh, oh my oh. goodness me! That is frightening. Oh my goodness. That is Mark Weber at Valencia this year, times 100. Wow. Absolutely flat out, 200 k's an hour, curb. He didn't even touch Boothman's car, just nailed the curb. Vorarbeiten. Und hier sehen wir, was passiert ist. Mitten auf der Geraden biegt er ab, überschlägt sich beinahe. Und das bei Geschwindigkeiten von etwa 300 km/h. Have only seven and a half minutes plus one lap left. Oh my! Huge accident, a huge off. Ranji through a spam. PK is involved. There was another car that's airborne. And then. Way up on the curb, Peter Lee into the back, a complete corkscrew. He crash lands. Pedro Pique goes underneath. Okay, threw the kink on the back straightaway. Two cars in front of him, slips inside. He taps PJ, trying to pass him. Look at that. And he lands upside down on the track, rolling again, tumbling. Look at that. What a ride through that. Oh. That is unbelievable. And is that not a testament to the safety of these cars that this guy's looking to get out of there? Another look from overhead. Bill Jeffrey runs across the curbs and he takes that Sam McLeod with him. 
They all survive, and there's more contact and a huge moment this time coming up towards Le Combe. And that, I'm afraid, is the Carlin car upside down. Oh. Menezes, I fear, it's Ding beendet. It's not mehr aufgenommen. No, Eight minutes. And da sehen wir jetzt nochmal, was passiert ist. Nein, das ist das Auto ist alleine hier. Ja, und was ist das da oben? Kann ich nicht erkennen im Moment, was da passiert. Da vor der die Flagge winkt. Da steht er noch. Look at this. Takes a little bit too much curve. It hits once, twice. That launches the car right up in the air. And thankfully, the roll hoops. Dramatic happened in GP3. This is Konstantin Tarashenko. Look at that, Anthony. My yeah. goodness. It brings back memories for me at Le Mans in uh, two years ago. Wow. But uh, you see what happened there. It was the um, the sausage. The 24 on board with Byron De Four through the tri oval. He's cut down a tire and then he loses that tire right in the tri oval. Gets sideways, upside down. Remember, this is about 100 south. Oh, and another one. We are going to see a red flag, and that is a huge accident. That's Javier Villa, I think. And he's taken the top off uh, a water supply. Well, that's a very, very dramatic looking accident. Hunter Ray's car. So you can see that he got hit on the inside and up over the top, and you can see Ryan Hunter Ray moving his hands and he looks up in front of him and he goes, My gosh, I can't believe that. Oh, wow. Oh, so close. <laughs> the Toyota lights ablaze, make sure the slower cars see them. Here we go. Oh my God, oh my God, the Mercedes has taken off. That's Peter Dumbreck at the wheel of the number five Mercedes. The car flew right up in the air, over the barriers, over the wire, and into the trees. Let's look at this again. This is an awful accident.